back at Ottawa Comic Con 2023. It's Sunday. Let's check it out. You excited? So excited. Can't contain myself. All right, we're going to go check out Casper Van Dien and Grace Van Dien's panel, and then we're going to shoot the floor and do the usual geeky stuff. <laughs> Cards. And then yeah, Harry and the Hendersons. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, those old, those the old Batman cards that he's got. Growing pains head cards? What? No way! Man! Marvel University. Still got those. Uh, all these collectible cups. Like ESO or something, you know, when you fill up and you get either cartoons, these uh, yeah. glasses, McDonald's, Burger King. Burger King. There's a McDonald's, there's a Shrek stuff for McDonald's. Yeah, that's the toxic paint one there. Oh. <laughs> I don't think it was that toxic, but we took them off just in case. And then, uh, yeah, this guy's got a whole lot of action figures, and I'm not going to do a very good job of panning here, sorry, but there's too many people and they can't take too much time. Of course. <laughs> Kara carefully ponders her potential purchases. There's some beautiful uh, <laughs> belt buckles. See? Oh yeah, that looks familiar. Like really it really is. Celtic. Yeah. Maybe. Tree of life. Yeah. yeah, that's that's pretty. <laughs> that's pretty mess. Yeah. <laughs> they cuffs you today. Bracers? Bracer. Okay. I know that because I played Assassin's Creed. I know bracers. There. Alright. Can you can you hide a dagger in there? Shh, you're not supposed to say anything about that dagger. No. No, I'm supposed to know. <laughs> so this is Exodus LARP Systems. Exodus LARP Systems Lore and Loot. Ah. Uh, we are a LARP company based in Eastern Ontario. We run two games and then our Emporium has stuff that we and our player base make. <laughs> okay. And pardon me, I got a 10 to my chance. <laughs> no worries, thank you. Ah, uh, yes. So, Alright, let's get these little books over yeah. here too. Saying hi to our new neighbors. Cool. <laughs> oh, my brother in law is doing a panel right now, but brought this back with Japan. Really interesting little thing that he's programmed. Here we are at Arthur Soydem's booth. He's the artist for Marvel Zombies, for Deadpool, Walking Dead, and zombified versions of classic covers and characters. Yeah, we are. Yeah. Was the man himself? Yeah. So it's a lot cheaper. Okay. He allowed me to film. Thank you. <laughs> Never mind. Cool. And Dan Parent's booth. All the awesome Archie arts work. Josie and the Pussycats. These are all variant covers. Look at that. Weekend at Archie's. <laughs> and Street Fighter. And Mario. It's like, no, no. Your attention, please. If any of you are interested in playing with me, she's all I got. Really great artist. A lot of Archie and a lot of other stuff. Really like the way she draws eyes. This is the best one right here. Love that print. I'm getting that. 
them in the holograms. And it looks like Alright. <laughs> awesome stuff. Some more here. And... Here, get the these are all hand painted. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, I was just showing off your card. Every one of these. Cool. Wait, you got the cyborg down there. Awesome. All right, now I'm going to show the card. Hopefully it's in focus. And it's not going to be easy. There we go. All right, Cat Jam Custom Creations. Check them out. <laughs> Thank you, no problem. It's okay if you pass through. It's, big... it's a busy Comic-Con. It's okay, people can pass right through. We got the shot. That is friggin' awesome. I'd love to have one of these in my room. Happy little tree mints. Lots of mints here at this booth. It's always awesome. This is the uh, candy slash toy table. Looks like it's been at many, many, many conventions. And Kara is buying a box of Reese peanut butter and chocolate premium dessert bar mix. I'm going. For my coworkers. I'm jealous that I can't have that, or I shouldn't anyway. <laughs> Everybody's feet are tired, and everybody's deodorant has failed, and uh, no, I'm just kidding, but it's actually really a really good time here. Um, it's a bit more limited than past cons, naturally, because of the WGA and uh, SAG after strike down in LA, so it's a little frustrating because there can't be as many guests, and the guests can't talk a lot about their work, and we're here to celebrate their work, but they can't really talk about it. So, Kara and I, you know, we did the Casper Van Dien and Grace Van Dien panel, and they were great. You know, known for Starship Troopers, known for, uh, she's known for uh, Stranger Things, but you can't talk about it, right? So, but they were cool, very nice, um, and a lot of good questions from the crowd. And uh, Kara got some stuff. I'm going to show off some swag for that Kara guy. So this is from Dan Parent, and uh, I will show off the signature at the top left there as well. That's that, that, that in frame. <laughs> All right. And uh, yeah. So that was good. Kara also got some uh, some sugary uh, pastry there, uh, some cakes, and I can't eat, unfortunately. But, um, but yeah, so we, uh, we we saw uh, Giselle as well, great artist. Um, she does a lot of parody work. She did Archie uh, meets Predator, and I want to get a print of that. Uh, bumped into Lee Demar, the director of uh, Enter the Drag Dragon, so you'll see that here as well. And. Uh, Oh yeah, we met the Trailer Park Boys. So we talked to the Trailer Park Boys uh, and Jean-Paul, Rob, and Mike, and they were all awesome as usual. And we talked to uh, Melinda as well, Melinda Clark from Return of the Living Dead 3, from Spawn, from the OC. She's got a podcast called Bye Bitches. <laughs> Bye Bitches, that's the name of the podcast, so check that out. And um, yeah, it's been actually really good here. You know, we made the most of, uh, of our time here and, and getting a lot of uh, cool stuff, so. 
that's 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 enough for me, I think. So uh, that's all for Ottawa Comic Con, guys. Until next year. <laughs>